Hey guys, back with another read aloud today. Today I'm going to read to you from the dock because we're reading Does a Fiddler Crab Fiddle? And I figured that I should read the book Does a Fiddler Crab Fiddle by the Fiddler Crabs. So let's see if we can find a Fiddler Crab in the marsh. Let's see. Ooh, there's one right here. We're gonna learn why it's a little hard to find them. Uh-oh, oh, there he is. You see him? There is a Fiddler Crab right there. It's kind of hard to see. There he is, right there. You see him? That's a Fiddler Crab. And the Fiddler Crab live in the marsh right here, okay? So we're gonna read, Does a Fiddler Crab Fiddle? And the really cool thing about this book is this book is actually nonfiction. If you were to look at the cover, would you believe that this book is nonfiction? This is a real book? No, but the cool thing is the illustrator made our pictures fun based off the questions that the author asks throughout the book. But then the author answers with facts about fiddler crabs, which is what makes it a nonfiction book. It gives us facts about the fiddler crabs, even though our illustrations don't really make us think that it's going to be a nonfiction book, which makes this book super cool and interesting. So let's get started and listen to some of these questions that the author asks us about fiddler crabs and learn some information about these really cool creatures. Does a Fiddler Crab Fiddle by Corinne Demas and Artemis Roherk. Paintings by John Sanford. Does a Fiddler Crab Fiddle by Corinne Demas and Artemis Roherk. Paintings by John Sanford. Very pretty illustrations. Does a fiddler crab fiddle? What do you think? No, but his one enormous claw looks like a fiddle. He waves it so other crabs will think he's tough. So if you ever wondered why one claw is bigger than the other, that's why. Does a fiddler crab build a sandcastle? but he digs a hole a foot deep in the salt marsh. He piles balls of sand from his tunnel by his front door. Does a fiddler crab use a snorkel? This is a snorkel. It helps people breathe underwater. No, but when the tide comes up, he scuttles to his hole and breathes air that is trapped inside. So if you ever wondered, a fiddler crab breeds air, but he can live in this hole by these little bubbles that he traps inside. Does a fiddler crab eat pizza? No, but he gobbles all up salt marsh muck, swallows everything yummy, and spits out little pellets of sand. So if you've ever seen these little pellets of sand, <laughs> that may be that that may be spit from a fiddler crab. Ew. Does a fiddler crab do magic tricks? What do you think? No, but his shell can change color. It gets darker or lighter to help him hide. It's called camouflage. Camouflage is something that um that animals use to help them hide from predators. Does a fiddler crab wear sunglasses? No, but he, let, he has eyes on stalks so he can see all around and look out for danger. These are stalks and you see his little eyeballs on top. Stalks right there in his eyeballs. And see that those birds must be trying to eat him. Those must be his predators. Does a fiddler crab ride a skateboard? No, but he runs sideways to the left 
or the right to so the shore birds can't catch him. So that must be a shore bird. And he runs to the left and the to the left and the right. He runs back and forth sideways. He runs sideways to help birds not catch him. Does a fiddler crab listen to the radio? No, but he can feel the vibrations of your footsteps when you try to creep up close. Does a fiddler crab use a bandage? See all his band-aids? Those are bandages. No, but if he loses one of his two claws or one of his eight walking legs, he can grow it back again. So remember we learned that about the lizard when we read Legree the lizard the other day? We actually learned that lizards grow back their tails. So that's pretty cool. A fiddler crab, if he loses one of his eight legs or one of his two claws, he can grow it back again. Does a fiddler crab fly south when it gets cold? No. All winter long, he sleeps safe in his tunnel until warm spring comes again. So he sleeps all winter long. That must mean that he hibernates. I didn't know that about fiddler crabs. Here's an author's note, and it gives us some more information about fiddler crabs and even gives us this diagram about fiddler crabs labeling the different parts of the fiddler crab. That's pretty cool. So, what cool and interesting things did you learn about fiddler crabs in this book? Some of the things I didn't even know about fiddler crabs. So, what I want you to do is I want you to think about one fact that's a true statement that you learned about fiddler crabs today. And I want you to write it down so you can practice your writing. But also, what else do I want you to do? Go take your AR test.